Are sleep apps tracking accurate? No. But there are some benefits. Keep watching. Sleepguards.com I'm Brandon. If you're new here and you're interested in getting a higher quality sleep, then head to sleepguards.com slash video to get my free animated video on 21 sleeping tips. Most sleep trackers work by using activity to monitor movement, and an accelerometer is used to measure how fast you move in your sleep to help determine how restful you are. And the Sleep Cycle app in particular uses your smartphone's microphone to monitor sound and help determine sleep states and movement. Let's look at the upsides. You're able to get a rough idea of how much time you spent in each sleep state, but the accuracy is definitely far from perfect. You can tell when, if, and how much you snore, which is useful. The sound paints a picture of how much you toss and turn and rustle in your sheets, and you know, whatever other activities you might be up to in the night. <coughs> <coughs> My favorite app for tracking sound is Snore Labs. I'm not endorsed by these guys, this is just an app I've used myself, and I love it. A 2016 study showed that those who tracked sleep on their wearable devices started sleeping more hours each night. We could make the assumption that this would also apply to those who use a sleep app. Now let's explore the downsides. A pet jumping on your bed can mess with your data. Apps alone do not measure your heart rate or body temperature like some wearables do, like this one, the Aura Ring. This means less reliable data. Both wearables and apps do not use EEG technology to measure brainwave patterns like sleep researchers do which is one of the most reliable ways to measure which stage of sleep you're in. And according to Dr. Carl Basil, there's no way of wearables or sleep apps to measure your REM sleep. So yeah, he mainly thinks it's just garbage. Just, just garbage. The smart wake up functions of sleep apps are meant to wake you up during light states of sleep so you don't feel groggy in the morning. Rosalie Chan posted an article on inverse.com sharing her experience using five different sleep apps simultaneously to wake her up. The alarms all went off at different times, indicating that sleep apps are garbage. To sum up, if you're serious about tracking your sleep with higher accuracy, then I at least suggest using something like a wearable. This is the Aura Ring. Because it measures your heart dynamics, pulse strength, body temperature, so you get more reliable data. Now my personal opinion, I'd much rather wear a wearable because I trust the data a heck of a lot more than just putting a phone next to your bed and basically crossing your fingers and hoping for the best. Before you go, if you're interested in getting a higher quality sleep and waking up feeling refreshed, energized, and ready to make more money, then head to sleepgods.com slash video to get my free animated video on 21 sleeping tips. Subscribe and watch the next video.